What's up everyone? It is your boy Joe. I just got off work and I'm freaking starving, so it's time to cook. We're gonna I'm gonna film how to cook a healthy protein heavy meal and I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna calculate my meals and everything. Before I get started, I should change out of my clothes into something more a chef would wear, right? Yeah, this, this is going to be a very simple meal and there is no right answer to this. Um, this is just how I want to cook it for the dinner today and maybe leave some food for tomorrow lunch, maybe. Mm, we'll see. And, you know, it really depends on your diet and I'm not really good at cooking. So this is kind of like an experimental cooking show. So we're going to figure this out together. I'll document my process of how I'm going to cook my dinner today and let's have some fun okay also it is always important to wash your hands first before cooking um so just to let you know i wash my hands okay this is going to be the game plan we're gonna wash the veggies first and we're gonna cut this up and then we're gonna cut up our chicken and then we're gonna throw it on the pan and see what happens and so we're gonna first wash up the green bell pepper and the yellow bell pepper. And it's time to cut it up. You guys are definitely gonna make fun of me Ta -da! Okay, so that's good enough for cutting up the veggies. Okay, so I prepared the veggies first because I need to use the same knife and it is safer to use the knife when you use the veggies first because chicken has some bacteria and you can avoid food poisoning. So each of this chicken breast is probably around 100 grams, so that is 300 grams and I think the conversion rate between 100 grams of chicken to protein is about 34 35 grams so of protein per 100 grams of chicken so we're talking uh, 105 grams of protein in this three chicken breasts I'll probably write it down in the in the comment below on how the conversion rates work and now I'm gonna chop this up into smaller pieces and throw it on the pan and just start cooking We got some nice, good-looking chicken breasts. It's gonna get loud in here because I wanna get the ventilation going, so cue background music. So there is a saying, muscles are punished in the gym and abs are made in the kitchen. So that basically says that yes, working out is very important. However, it's the diet that makes a really big portion of how your body is going to look. And this is a very important question. What do you season your chicken with? You know, for me, I don't really season my chicken that much, but this is what I season my chicken with. So I season it with some sriracha, 
Himalayan pink salt and pepper. And throw the toaster on. And it's the moment of truth. By that means it's time to measure how much we're gonna eat for dinner. Okay, so the scale is set at zero grams. So let's start off with some protein measurement. Usually for a meal, I would try to stick with around 100 grams for protein or 100 grams of chicken breast if I'm eating chicken breast. And we're gonna reset this. Okay, and now it's time to throw on some veggies. And I think for veggies too, I would try to go for about the same weight, 100 grams. Okay, a little bit more. Bam! Okay, 100 grams of veggies and 112 grams of chicken and we have some carbs um, this is gonna be my dinner I'm gonna put some peanut butter on this bread and I'm gonna do a cinematic shot of how I plate this dinner now the chicken is in heart shape because protein is love protein is love all right, so there we go. That's my dinner. Happy, healthy eating, guys. Um, I don't always eat like this, but I do go. I also go out and eat. I also go out and eat with my friends. So this is just one of those nights where I decided to cook and eat healthy. <laughs> So I was just gonna end the video like that, but oh, this is not easy. I want something sweet, but <clears throat> I gotta eat this because protein is love. So healthy eating is not nice. It's not easy. <sighs> but for the gains, okay, so seriously now. Bye. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, ooh.